Hello friends, welcome back to our channel. Today we're diving into the fascinating world of finance with a focus on Larry Fink, the chairman and CEO of BlackRock. Did you know that BlackRock actually manages more money than GDP of most countries? Well, that's right. Larry Fink's journey and insights offer valuable lessons for anyone interested in finance. Let's explore his leadership, innovations, and his keys to success. Larry Fink is the driving force behind BlackRock, the largest asset manager in the world with over $10 trillion in assets. His journey started at first Boston as a bond trader after graduating from UCLA, USA. Despite his initial plans to work in real estate, Fink's career took a different path, leading to the founding of BlackRock in 1988. His vision was to create a client-focused firm that emphasized managing risk. This approach, coupled with a commitment to build a respected firm, set BlackRock on a path to success. Over the years, Larry Fink has become a trusted advisor to many heads of state, central bankers and finance ministers. In his early days, Fink was known for his innovative mindset. At first Boston, he specialized in mortgage-backed securities, which are investments made up of bundle of home loans. This role led to the groundwork for his future success and demonstrated his ability to navigate and lead in uncharted financial territories. Fink's work with mortgage-backed securities was a significant innovation that influenced the broader financial markets. These securities initially reduced interest rate spreads and made home ownership more accessible. However, the overextension into riskier loans, known as subprime mortgages, later contributed to the financial crisis. Despite this, Fink's ability to innovate and adapt remained a cornerstone of his career. The purchase of Barclays Global Investors BGI in 2009, which included the flagship iShares ETF unit was a game changer. By 2009, iShares had about $340 billion in client assets, which then grew to about $3.1 trillion in assets. This acquisition allowed BlackRock to expand its product offering and global footprint significantly. What do you think about the impact of such a large acquisition on the market? Let us know in the comment section below. Fink believes that the culture is a cornerstone of BlackRock's success. A significant aspect of this culture is the use of unified technology platform, which has been crucial in integrating acquisitions and facilitating global growth. BlackRock uses technology to create customized investment solutions, making investing accessible to more people, and building a strong client relationship amongst their clients. This technology platform enhances risk management and allows for a creation of tailored investment portfolios. Portfolios. Clients trust BlackRock with over $10 trillion in assets, seeking outcomes such as total returns, tax-adjusted returns, and secure management of the retirement assets. The majority of the assets managed by BlackRock are retirement assets, and the firm focuses on long-term, stable growth rather than short-term market movements. Larry Fink has been a strong advocate for ESG, that's environmental, social, and governance practices. Since 2019, he has emphasized the importance of good diversity and environmental practices within companies BlackRock invests in. This shift was driven by a significant increase in client interest in sustainability and governance. Fink believes sustainability is becoming as crucial as other risk management metrics and has integrated it deeply into BlackRock's investment strategy. Fink's global travels and meetings with heads of states, policymakers, and clients provides valuable information that shapes BlackRock's policy strategies. The COVID-19 pandemic highlighted the importance of personal interactions which were missed during lockdowns. Fink shares that one of his favorite trips was to Saudi Arabia, where he learned invaluable insights on the Middle East politics and energy. He also highlights common mistakes investors make, such as becoming too accustomed to a particular economic environment. Fink warns the challenges of inflation and changing liquidity and interest rate conditions can significantly impact investment outcomes. He emphasizes the importance of being adaptable and prepared for different economic scenarios. Have you ever adjusted your investment strategy based on changing economic conditions? If so, share experience in the comment section below. Fink encourages continuous learning and adaptation in the finance industry. He believes that staying relevant and constantly learning is crucial for a successful career in finance and investment. He advises young trainees at BlackRock to embrace lifelong education and growth. According to Fink, 
the moment you stop learning and growing is when you actually fall behind. When asked what he would have done if he didn't go into finance, Fink speculates he might have pursued a career in real estate. However, he doubts if he would ever become the biggest developer in the world. This humility and willingness to acknowledge different paths highlights Fink's grounded nature and his focus on finding success through passion and dedication. Larry Fink's journey from a born trader to the CEO of the largest asset management firm in the world offers invaluable lessons. His emphasis on client focus, strategic growth, technology, culture, and continuous learning provides a roadmap for success in the financial industry. If you guys found this video to be helpful, please like, share, subscribe to our channel for more such insights into the finance world. Until then, stay safe and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye for now.